first time I saw a round barn, I knew I wanted to write about it. In my research, I discovered that the Chinese employed them for horse-powered mills during the Han Dynasty. Accustomed to the square, right-angled architecture of conventional barns, I imagined a farmer breaking with tradition. This led me to speculate on the origins of such creativity. Something to think about. What buildings or monuments or homes strike you as especially original? How do they pressure or expand community standards? The round barn. I wonder if the horses balked at the curvature, anticipating clean indigenous right angles. They must have paced the perimeter like their Chinese forebears, circling the shafts that powered the mills in the Han Dynasty. And did the farmer mourn the end of linear thinking? Did he pause to consider the rectangles of daily life? Haystacks, windows, narrow rows of corn in their righteous beds. Good farmer, when you broke with your neighbors and led your livestock into the center of the cosmos, were you only following a hunch that the wind would sweep around the progressive curves that revolution would harbor you. Perhaps you saw in the repetitions of history the wandering Mongolian sleeping naked in his yurt who knew the world was a simple sphere with an opening at the top for God.